Well, hello, lovely people. Welcome to my channel, Jasmine Inspires. I'm up, I'm ready, I'm inspired to be a better me, and hopefully you are inspired too. As you guys can see, I'm in my, well, not my garage, my brother's garage, and I'm working out on the treadmill today. I do not have any workout clothes, as you guys can see, but I don't plan on doing like sweating, sweating. I just wanna just make sure I get some steps in. We are supposed to be leaving today. So it's like I'm just needing to do a little bit of something before I get up on that road. So um, I just kinda of want to show you guys what I'm gonna be doing as a workout. I actually just started. I only burnt, burnt seven calories so far. So we gonna have to get some more time in on this machine. But I hope you guys are doing good. I hope you guys are inspired to do something great. Um, whether it is working out, whether it is eating healthy, whether it is cutting off people that you don't need in your life that's causing frustration, whether that is trying something new, maybe going hiking or maybe, I don't know what it could be. But hopefully you're inspired to be a better you. So I'm just going to go ahead, get back on this machine, stay focused so that I can get through this 30 minute workout. All right, you guys. All right, you guys. So I want to show you, which I'm still on it now, but I just kind of want to show you where I'm at at 30 minutes. Sorry if the camera is shaking. But as you can see, I burned 212 calories in 30 minutes. I walked 1.3 miles. And I'm at an incline of a 4.5 and a speed of 3.0. So I just wanted to show you guys that. Hey you guys, so I wanted to show you guys that I stopped by Planet Smoothie again. Except this time I got their almond, it's a, um, it's a special that they're doing. It's an almond uh, butter muscle butter cup smoothie. I think I said that right or wrong, I don't know. But basically they put almond butter in there, cocoa, vanilla, whey protein, that type of stuff. And I actually have a 16 ounce guys it is so good so I'm drinking that that's probably about 480 to 500 uh, 10 calories so I just put it in my uh, fitness app and so that I can calculate those calories so I just wanted to kind of just show you guys that and we are on the road back so yeah always a delight seeing this beautiful city So it is right now May 12th and so I'm just once again time is dwindling down and it's getting closer and closer for me to weigh myself. All right so I do have some things to let you guys know because I told you that I was going to be absolutely transparent with you guys during this fitness challenge so you know I might have my highs I have my lows and all that good stuff. So for the past three or four days as you guys know if you watched the clips from before um, or the videos from before, um, I was out of town. You guys, I don't know what it is about being out of town that just throws me off, but it threw me off. So you guys, I was eating Zaxby's, you know, I was just chowing down on some fried chicken and fries and all that stuff. And so I was like, oh my gosh, can't believe I'm doing this to myself and I'm pretty sure that we all have found ourselves in that area where you're like oh my gosh I messed up what is the use to continue to you know do this lifestyle change and all this stuff like that so we can actually talk ourselves out of it so I definitely was there I was like oh my gosh like I'm up here eating fries and fried chicken and stuff like that and I'm not really eating as healthy as I was eating and so it, it, it gets you down a little bit but I am not done. I'm going to continue to do this. Even though I fell off the wagon, this girl is getting back on that wagon. I'm going to keep on going, okay? So with that being said, I did not, um, over the last four days, I did not track any of my calories or anything like that. So today is the first day. Once again, it is May 12th. I am getting back on track. So yeah. Yeah, <laughs> so I'm going to be getting back on track. Um, and even though there's only like seven days left, it doesn't matter because I know that, you know, as you guys, I've explained this in the intro video that I did for this quarantine challenge is that this is a challenge on the side 
of a challenge that I'm already in at my church. I'm in a fitness challenge in my church. And so that's going to go all the way to August. So I might continue to document my journey like I've been doing, but I'm still kind of trying to figure that part out because you guys, if you don't know, if you've never done this before, it takes a lot. When you're trying to videotape every little thing that you're eating, as well as exercising every day and all that good stuff, I mean, it can take a whole lot and you're trying to get all this on camera. So I might, after this challenge, I might continue to video record or I might not, or I just might show you guys some snippets and stuff like that of where I'm at. But anywho, we're not going to focus on that. So I have not yet exercised and that's fine um, because I want to be getting ready to go to prayer. You know, and as you guys know, I always like to walk and stuff during my prayer time. So that's what I want to be doing. And but so far, I took 5,226 steps today. So I'm proud of myself. So I'll probably get about 10,000 uh, steps. Um, and it could be a little bit more depending on what if I decide to work out after I get home from praise team rehearsal and all that stuff like that. So, but yeah, um, I have ate. I actually ended up eating. Oh, I should show you guys what I ate. All right, so I want to show you guys what I've been consuming or what I've ate as far as for a snack today. It is these Harvest uh, Snacks and I really like them. They are really good. Um, I ate about 25 pieces and it's about 130 calories. And so I went ahead and I consumed some of that. I also brought these fig bars, as you guys can see, they are 210 calories. And so I have snacked on a whole bar today. So yeah, and I also ate, let me show you guys. I haven't ate all of these. I've ate in the toasted harvest wheat crackers and I ate 10 of those. And that was about 160 calories. So that's what I consumed today. Whew. I haven't really ate real, real, real food. Oh, I did also have a piece of sausage, like a half piece of sausage. And I ate like a little salad with ranch and Italian dressing. And yeah, that's what your girl consumed. All right, so right now I'm gonna get ready to go to the store because I gotta um, pick up some things for dinner tonight. Um, I'm not probably not gonna eat what I'm cooking for my husband because, like I said, I'm trying to do better. This girl get back on track, but um, but yeah. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. Hey, you guys. So before I go to bed, I just want to show you guys what workouts I've done today. Well, not what workout, but um, my steps and everything that I did today. I close out all right so let's go to our steps as you guys see I took 12,335 steps today and I'm actually going to show you guys Let me click on that I walked for 47 minutes today and Let's see, this is the one we need. 47 minutes, so that's about 1 mile, 1.8 miles, and I burned up about 194 calories. So you guys are able to see that. Um, yesterday, I walked only 0.86 miles, and that was about 91 calories. Let me show you guys. And Sunday... I have different workouts for Sunday because we have two services and I'm always moving around. But 20 minutes, I burned 107 calories. For 11 minutes, I burned 50 calories. 21 minutes, I burned 67 calories as you guys can see the time. So all this is from Sunday. All right, 9.11 to 9.44, I burnt 113 calories. And as you guys can see, the last time that I really did work out was Thursday. So Friday, Saturday, I was like, I was not working out. 
So I just wanted to show you guys that. If you have not subscribed, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a video. You guys, it is May 13th. It is the 24th day of the fitness challenge. And y'all, right now, as you guys can see, I'm in my bed. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I am in my bed. I'm just getting in the word of God. If there's ever a time to be getting in the word of God and really just soaking in his presence and just getting in his word, the time is now, y'all. The time is now. So that's what I'm doing right now. Just enjoying being in my word. And yeah, I have not worked out yet, but hopefully I'll get a workout in. Um, I don't know. Guys, I'm going to tell you what. Today has just been like a really chill day. Like right now, oh yeah, just let y'all know, it is 524. It is 524 p.m. So I'm just now picking up the camera because I've been, I had to go to my job this morning. I've been up there and came back and just chilling here at the house and just, I don't know, feeling like, ugh. And sometimes you might have those days where you just feel like, ugh. <laughs> but the important thing is is that even though you may feel like that don't let that get you down like i said i'm getting in my word y'all i'm getting in my word soon i'm going to have to go to bible study so we're going to get in some more word there and hopefully i will exercise but i'll let y'all know um today i did eat i ended up what did i eat today hmm i ate two eggs i scrambled me some eggs so I ate two eggs. I had um, a crab cake, which I made. I made the crab cakes. Um, I had those. And what else did I eat? I don't remember what else I ate. But anyway, that was good. Tonight I'll probably have broccoli, mushrooms, and chicken with carrots and a side of rice. Um, and that might be what I eat. I think I'm going to eat that tonight. But anyway... I'll see you guys later.